Hola, que tal? Hello everybody. I'm, I have two special guests today. They are Antonio Jr. Martinez de Murga Olaivar and Carlos Alberto Martinez de Murga Olaivar. Welcome. And of course, they're a member of the Philippine national team and various clubs here in the Philippines. Carly plays for Global and you played for, used to play for Peralto. All right. So now both of you are half Filipino. Um, tell us about your mother, Antonio. Yeah, my mother is, uh, I want to about her. She's Filipina. Yeah, she's Filipina. From where? From Quezon City. Quezon City. Yeah, but uh, my grandfather is from Bohol and my Lola, my grandmother, she's from Samar. Mm. But my man grew up in Quezon City. Yeah, now before you came here for football, did you ever come to the Philippines before? No, not before, just. Never? No, my first time was 2011 just for football. For I remember that. And you just yeah, came just, this year? Yeah, in January. So can I ask you, what do you think of the Philippines? Like honestly. The day, yeah, honestly, the weather is good, the people is nice, you know, I like a lot. It's a lot of beautiful place. I only uh, could be in uh, Cebu, Bohol, and uh, Adi Rasa, and it's amazing. And you, Carly, you've been here for two years. So far, so good? Yeah. You, yeah, you, you like some things and you don't like some things. I don't like the traffic, but <laughs> I feel everyone don't. Everybody here doesn't like don't like the, the traffic, but people is so friendly. The weather is nice. Not now the rainy season, but today is good. Okay, so you're 24 years old, mm -hmm. and your brother is 26. So I want to know, you're now living together, and the both of you, are you close as brothers, or are you always fighting? Like, what kind of brother relationship do you have? Yeah, we are really close. Of course, we sometimes we have. Fighting, we have fight, a bit fight, you know. I think we are really close. Yeah, we're really close. We, we take care of each other really good. Yeah, so you apparently you're very close family ties in Spain, right? Yeah, yeah. So when you come here, don't you, I mean, you miss your family back home? Every day, I miss my family. Every day? Every day. Oh. Yeah, because sometimes I think my mom she's alone there in Spain, so then I get sad. Yeah, and now you brought your brother here now. <laughs> Right? So tell us about your football. What um what do you think of your like playing with the UFL and the league? Well in 2011 I, I made my made my decision to came here to Philippines. So I think it's the best thing I did. Really? Because, yeah. Football here is uh, getting better. Also I can play with the national team yeah. every game without problem. So I I made the good the best decision. And how did you get started in football in Spain? That every kid in Spain plays football. Yeah, yeah. Most of them. That means the famous part in Spain. Yeah. And when you were young, obviously you knew your mother was Filipino. Did you ever ask her about the Philippines? Did she speak to you in Filipino? Or did you know anything about the Philippines? No. Uh, yeah, sometimes my mom told us many things here about Philippines. Then I I was asking many times about the Filipino wars, but he said to us, better if you focus in English, because it's more, more important. But of course, some things uh, she teach us, yeah. like Lolo, Lola, Inez, oh. basic things. <laughs> yeah. But you feel more Spanish than Filipino, obviously, right? Uh, because I grow up, but I, feel, I really feel like a Filipino also. You know? And apparently you like Filipino food. Yeah, I like it. Right? You cook some Filipino food. What yeah, food do you like? Uh, my favorite dish, I think, is uh, bistec. Bistec Tagalog. Yeah, <laughs> I, I really love that, that dish. What about you, Carly? Adobo. 100% adobo. Adobo? <laughs> with rice? With rice. White rice? White rice. Wow. What is, the, what is the best part you think about being in the Philippines? I mean, it must feel different for you to discover another country that you're actually a part of. Yeah, for me the best thing here, for me is a play representing the team, the yeah. country. Yeah. It's a big responsibility. You are not playing for a club, you are playing for, for, for the whole country, for one nation. Yeah, so it's a diff very different but special feeling. Yeah, right? it's a really special feeling. Yeah. And did you ever think that you would one day do that? No. 
I think this is a, the dream of every kid who starts to play football, represent uh, one country. So it's like I made my like my dream country. Now, how far do you think the Philippine team can go? And what should be done to improve the team? I don't know, because uh, little by little we are getting better. We still, we still don't know how good we are. So we have uh, next year we have a big import, uh, big tournament. If we can win this tournament, we will play Asian Cup. So this is the yeah. highest thing. And obviously, you see how because before football was nothing in the Philippines, but now it's quite popular. So how does it make you feel that you know you have lots of fans here, and then like now you have you even you're a model now, like you got to do some commercial stints. So how does that make you feel? Makes me feel uh, proud of me and my teammates, for example, because uh, what you told us is getting famous, uh, the football here in Philippines, yeah. and we are part of this. Yeah. So, makes me feel proud. Yeah. And you, your new career in Mama. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I couldn't believe that I, I so, can yeah. do things on some other. You never thought of no, being No, never. So tell us what you've done. I never planned that I'd be a model, because I never thought that I can be a model, you know. So, I noticed you already shaved it. For the, for, the, for the shoot, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so tell us what you've done. You've done some ramp modeling for Fashion Week. Yeah. Uh, three commercials already. Three commercials. Uh, wow. One, uh, ABP. So you like it? You're getting used to yeah, it? Yeah, it's, it's good. It's fine. It is funny. It's fine. Yeah, my, my mom saw this. She also cannot believe it. Nice. <laughs> now, do you both have girlfriends, may I ask? No, not now. Oh, you don't? No. Oh, so you're what? Just focusing on your football? Yeah, right now just focus on my work. Football. And you have had an injury, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. So you have a knee injury yeah. that you're hoping to be able to get back. Yeah, I hope. Right? I hope now, back. do you think you will stay in the Philippines or you're not sure? Yeah, yeah. I, I want to stay here because uh, Spain has a chance for, for having a job. For, so that's why. And that's why I like the country. Yeah, and you're going back this summer for a while? Yeah, I yes. want. I want. Are you or not? Sure? I don't know yet. Maybe in August, if I have uh, time, I go for visit my mom and my family. Now, your mom is a Filipina, but she speaks full Spanish? Yes. Yeah. So, uh, are you learning Tagalog? Yeah. Okay, so tell us some words that you know in Tagalog, Filipino. Carly first. Hello, magandang hapon po. Ako si Carly de Murga. At uh, si kapatid ko, Antonio de Murga. <laughs> Uh, sobra mainit ngayon <laughs> pero okay lang oh that is so I'm sure you don't know any of that yet konti lang konti lang konti lang pawis kapatid ko mas mas maganda yung Tagalog eh. wow you are really true Pinoy's well we welcome you to the Philippines we're so glad you're here and we wish that you would stay a long time and I hope that your mother can come and visit because it seems like you really love her and that you're you know you have this closeness so why didn't she come back here to visit? She was here April. In April. Maybe next year she, she will come back. Now it's turn for my dad. Maybe he come in September. Right. Okay, next time you're going to show me how you cook adobo, bistec tagalog, and what's the third one? One seat. I heard you're a very good cook. So next time I will see how you cook, if it's true, and I will taste it and give you my opinion. Okay. How are you like? <laughs> Thank you. Thank Antonio you. Jr. and Carlos Alberto. Martinez de Murga Oliva. Muchas gracias. Yeah. <laughs>